Well, Michael Jordan does it all the time. Charlize Theron did it recently. Yeah, shaving your head can be an act of liberation, but it's hard to see it that way when baldness is forced on someone because of cancer treatment. Now, we met a family trying to make that easier. The organization is called Heal Courageously. What we do is we come to you in these moments where you're being tested and we honor your strength and your courage and what it takes to get through it. Each participant does a photo shoot before, during, and after shaving their head. The idea is to recognize the cancer patient's struggle and honor her courage. For women like Lisa Duckworth, the organization has brought some control back to an often unpredictable situation. Part of the reason I have chosen to shave my head is because there's so many things that you have out of your control when you are faced with breast cancer. And so I felt like this is a way for me to exert some control over the situation. For Lisa, the courage is communal. When she shaved her head, her husband shaved his, and other members of her family followed. My husband's going through, um, he's going through some pretty bad stuff, and so uh, I thought I could keep it together, but. <laughs> But it's hard and, you know, your family, they deal with these, this horrible thing that they never thought they'd have to deal with, having to face the possible loss of a loved one. And, and I'm so active with my family. I'm like, I know they'd miss me because I'm there all the time. <laughs> so, you know, it's really great. They're, they've been such a great support. Hey, Nick. So heartbreaking. Yeah, we need but to thank her for thank you for sharing that with yes, us. That is really it's something. Really personal, yeah. yeah and a, a neat family. Well, if you would like to learn more about Heal Courageously and how you can help those fighting breast cancer, you can head to fox13now.com.